What time is it? What time is it? What time is it? And now, ladies and gentlemen in attendance, and boxing fans joining us around the world, it's showtime! Welcome to Big Faces Worldwide, where we talking nothing but this boxing, man. What's good, fam? Hey, listen, man. First off, I want to welcome everybody to the channel. Uh, if you're new here, I want you to be here. So think about tapping on that subscribe button as we stay knee deep into this boxing conversation, man. Earl Spence, Sean Porter, man. They had a, a press conference out in L.A. yesterday, man. Um, Earl's energy... Uh, as it was, as I mentioned it was with the Mikey fight was low, you know, um, there was a lack of energy, um, you know, and, you know, I, I made a video about about Earl on the Mikey fight, you know, about the same thing, man, you know what I'm saying? This is a, a pay-per-view fight, man, you want to attract as many casual fans, as many viewers as you can you know what i'm saying um and earl just gets up there and you know really just quiet as a mouse and you know people want to see animosity people want to see controversy people want to see some type of uh energy out of both opponents man if you go up there and just act like it's just business as usual man like um you know you really you know you really don't care to be there and you know all that type of stuff right there it's not gonna go over too well with the public man you know if you you wonder why Manny Pacquiao Adrian Broner um, did good numbers it's because of Adrian Broner talking shit you know um, in a combination with Manny Pacquiao being who he was and you wonder why the Keith Thurman Pacquiao numbers did did better than Broner's because Keith Thurman was hyping the fight up with the combination of who uh, Manny Pacquiao was. In the case of Sean Porter, Earl Spence, you don't have a Manny Pacquiao. You know what I'm saying? So you don't you you got to sell the fight. You got to come with some type of uh intensity to make you know fans want to tune in man and you know i know it's going to be a good fight i know earl spence is going to fight his ass off i know earl spence is um you know a beast a monster but the people who who you want to buy this fight don't necessarily know who you are you know and when they click the tv and watch this press conference of this guy you know so quiet and meek and you know that's not going to entice them to 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 buy the pay-per-view so i hope earl you know brings that energy back up man um you know i liked it you know the first press conference you know was was lit man you know they was going back and forth and you know earl was telling them you know uh the family dinner scenario and you know he was talking about how uh uh you know sean didn't want to fight he wanted to fight you know that's why they're fighting you know things like that you know uh he gonna knock him out and he gonna you know do this and that to him and try to box him and he gonna knock him on his ass you know that's what the fans want to see man they don't want to see this gentleman type shit man you know i ain't saying you gotta be a clown and, and uh you know go out of character man but you know you want to you want to say what's on your mind i know there's things on earl spence's mind that you know he he want to say about sean porter say it you know say it we want to hear it you know but um listen i appreciate y'all tuning in man uh check me out on twitter on instagram at big faces worldwide all one word but in the meantime and in between time stay blessed and keep on supporting the sport we love called boxing peace i'll holler back